Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back everyone. So today's video is a very special one. We have our 40,000 subscriber giveaway. And if you're new to this channel, welcome. So make sure to stick around because we will be announcing the giveaway sometime during the video. So that will be a little surprise where. But um, yeah, so far we have some goodies right here. These are like some natural fruit roll-ups and they're really good and good for you. So it looked like uh, Old Navy was throwing out some of their goodies. I think this is like at the end of the line when you're like up next to pay and then they have like all these snacks and stuff for you because you know, they want you to buy more stuff before you check out. So I'm thinking that's what it is. I don't know, did they have like a food section or maybe? I haven't been there in a while. They got some sun chips, fruit roll-ups, and dunkaroos. Not bad. Not bad, not bad at all. That's a good snack, so. Nice little haul right there. Okay, and we have a person that um, needs hangers, <laughs> so we do have a local business that, you know, they have access to vault for hangers, so we are collecting those. So those can be used. Some more little goodie bags. And like I said about the giveaway, thank you everyone. Thank you to our members as well. So in case you are new again, uh, we do have some banners below just to give a little shout out to our members and also to our subscribers. So make sure to leave a comment on this video to be featured in our next one. Sometimes you just gotta get in there and look around because a lot of times the stores they try to hide stuff especially the good stuff underneath boxes and bags so sometimes you struggle to get in there and there is some strawberry flavor and raspberry flavor. Huh? <laughs> ah. <laughs> I was watching Mr. Volt when he pulled that bag out. <laughs> See right through it. So that was not gonna work but luckily he had the box because there are some good fruits in here. <laughs> well, not everything. The pineapple was a little soft. Um, but yeah, the bananas are good. And you guys already know that you know if they get a little brown, they are perfect for banana bread. But of course, you know, the stores have to get rid of them, but they should have a section like banana bread bananas, the ones that are starting to turn brown. And here we have a little glimpse of our cleaning process. So after we bring like fruits and veggies, we just put you know, some water with some vinegar and give them a good scrub. And let us know if you recognize this beautiful shelf right here. This was in our last video, and yeah, it was a, a little worn. I mean, Mr. Volt reinforced it and fixed it up a little bit. But now look at it. it was saved from the dumpster, and it is beautiful. <laughs> so that's our little fruit display right there. And 
back to the dumpster. So, no, we did not wash them on the spot, but that's the magic of YouTube. And Mr. Volt got some new gloves. <laughs> he likes this brand, it's really good. So, it has like a little grip to it and stuff, and yeah, he's loving them. So now, we're at the $1.25 store, which is still a good price. I mean, I gotta say, Dollar Tree, you know, they did raise up their prices a little bit, but they still have some good deals. So these are just a little squished, but still good. And these lights were good, they just needed a, a little charge. So they're all uh, solar panel little lights. So we will be using those to come with the garden. And we are saving the lids just in case we find the containers for them later. So we will hold them for a little bit. back up. So here we have a dumpster that they always throw the boxes out for the shoes and I know you can probably sell these too on eBay. Someone had left a comment about that. Um, but we usually just you know ship them without the boxes. But if you sell them maybe like swap meet or maybe like online type of thing then yeah you can take the boxes if you sell a lot of shoes because I'm sure you know that'll just you know raise the value of your shoes or if you want to use them for projects or stuff like that there's always boxes in the dumpsters alrighty so the moment you guys have all been waiting for <laughs> So we have our giveaway, and this is for our 40,000 subscribers, so we want to say a big, big thank you again to all of you guys. Um, you guys have helped this channel grow to where it's at today, and hopefully we can continue to grow this channel. So we want to say a big thank you again, and let's get to it. <laughs> so we're going to go over here and grab this link for the video. And this is for the subscriber giveaway. Okay. So now, let's see. We have a YouTube comment picker. And we will enter the URL right here. Filter duplicate users. And we will exclude ourselves. So we will not win our own prize. And I guess we will include replies in case there's unique comments, but let's see. I guess I have to do a little math here. So 8 plus 3 is 11. And we will get to our comments. And we have 271 unique comments. So let's start. And a big, big congratulations to Jen Runhill. So thank you so much. Congratulations on an epic journey so far. Keep on grinding. You are doing great. Thank you so, so much. Um, we will let you know, you know, how to claim your prize. But um, yeah, congratulations. So we're going to have you send us an email. And I will reply to your comment and give you instructions on how to claim it. Thank you again and congratulations. So we are back from our giveaway. And again, big congratulations and thank you everyone. Um, again, we really do appreciate all of you guys, all of your support, subscribe, comment, all that stuff. 
We really do appreciate it. And we try to do giveaways, you know, when possible. So hopefully we can do another one pretty soon. Um, we'll see, maybe for 50,000 subscribers. So hopefully we can get to that soon, but we'll let you guys know when it gets a little bit closer. Um, but that's just our way of saying thank you because you, know, you guys are always supporting us and we just want to give a little thank you back to you guys. So again, we will leave a comment for the winner with our email and we will provide a code for you know, the person to edit their comment so we have a whole process so that person doesn't lose their money or you know we don't get scammed by some scammers because that was happening too um, but either way you know the winner's gonna get their prize so don't worry okay we found so much little Ziploc baggies. So there's a few boxes in here and a gift card to Amazon. And some hefty trash bags. <laughs> Again, I was gonna buy trash bags the other day and I was like, no, wait, should I get it? Or should I wait a few days and see? And then of course, Mr. Volt finds some. They were throwing out some vodka over here. <laughs> oh my goodness. I might just have to make myself a margarita after this. <laughs> yeah, they're like little bottles. They just throw them out like that. Um, I don't know about that, but... Yeah, we don't really drink that much anyways, but... This is the first time I'm watching it, so I really don't know how many bottles Mr. Hope found. But I do know that he did find a lot of these glasses, so... Crown Royale? I think that's what it said. I'm like trying to read this right now, but... Yeah, they're really pretty. So, you just take uh, the non-broken ones. right there. Got some more vodka. Some more vodka. More glasses. And we weren't even going to check this dumpster too. We were like already ready to head home. So we were going to try another route because we go out multiple times too a day. And uh, that's another thing too that I'm not sure if we mentioned. Um, yeah, we'll go out in the morning and then take a break, go back later. So, yeah, we just happened to stop by this one. Some more glasses. Some more vodka. Yep. I'm not having that many margaritas, so we are definitely going to share some of this. more trash bags <laughs> I'm like more excited about the trash bags than anything <laughs> Ooh, those are expensive and I'm so excited because I was gonna buy some too we needed some we do this we need extra trash bags too and more magazines and crossword puzzles so we did find a lot of these before and these were donated, so I'm sure we can, you know, donate a good amount from here, too. I was wondering why that box looks so heavy, like, Mr. Volt brought it to the car, and then you could, like, feel it, like, when he loaded it in. And yeah, 
now I see there is a lot of stuff in here. actually quite a bit in there too so yeah we can donate some of those trash bags and then just keep a few um, the ziploc bags we will keep because we do put stuff in them that we find and we use those for donations as well so the boxes are a little dirty um it was raining earlier too so the boxes look like they got a little wet um, but we'll take them out and put them in a new box. We have a lot of containers, so that's not a big deal at all. So that was a really good find too. So not bad. But wait, there's more. <laughs> I thought Mr. Volt was done. So you got some like, paper bowls right there. always be careful too like when you see broken glass in the dumpster just be careful when you're grabbing things or jumping in or something because yeah it can be dangerous so of course be careful and I want to give a big big shout out to all of you guys again make sure to like comment subscribe and have a great day bye